Hi guys, so in today's video, pag-uusapan natin itong white elephant. Let's go! Pag bago pa lang kayo sa channel, huwag nyong kalimutan na i-click yung subscribe button and palike na din ng video. And mag-notify kayo para pag may bago tayong NFT game, may bago tayong review, manonotify kayo ka agad. And I wish you the best of everything. So itong White Elephant guys ay isang NFT game project dito naman sa Solana blockchain. So i-check natin itong team nila. So ito yung team leader nila, Alan Villarta and the rest of the team. Vev Hilot, marketing nila, Luis. So ito yung kausap natin ngayon, si Vev Hilot. And dito naman yung studio nila, Alimango Studios. So this is a software and game development studio tailored for blockchain projects. So marunong sila ng AI and bots, games, and DAP. Ipapakita ko sa inyo mamaya lahat yan. And they are also a proud member of this organization's Blockchain Games Alliance or BGA. So ito yung parang umbrella association ng mga gaming projects. And uh, kasama dito yung mga games like Gala, Axie, and etc. Check nyo na lang guys kung ano yung mga nandyan sa BGA. And alam ko kasi malaking association to ng mga gaming projects. And itong Solaya which is yung Solana network collaboration ng projects so parang ito yung industry standard ngayon kung member kayo ng ganitong klaseng organization dyan na malalaman ngayon kung magrarag ba yung project or hindi lalo na dito sa mga NFT games na projects so isa ito sa mga tinitignan ko ngayon dun sa mga upcoming projects yung organizations nila like ito BGA and the Solayans partners naman nila Solardex, Solnet Tools tapos Workflow and ito nga uh, 21 hours and 55 minutes magkakaroon na ng NFT minting dito so yan yung mga solvent NFTs so nagbibuild sila ng ecosystem dito sa Solana Network meron silang DeFi Fund Arcade and Staking and they're na explain ko mamaya yan guys yung Fund Arcade Staking DeFi tapos solvent NFT so yung chinecheck muna natin ngayon yung legitimacy nitong project so sa token naman nila pwede natin silang i-check dito sa soul scan and meron din dito sa coin market cap so ito yung fund token nila dito sa coin market cap i-check natin so, bumagsak sa dito pero naka recover naman sa kagad soul scan tignan natin yung token nila dito transaction holders so meron silang 500 million token Yan yung total supply. Fully diluted market cap nila ngayon is uh, nasa 20 million. Ito naman yung active holders versus all holders. So yan, markets naman. Pwede natin siyang i-avail dito daw sa radium swap. So ang gagamitin nating wallet dito guys is ito. Phantom wallet. And kung gusto nyong mag-avail ng token nila, dito naman siya sa radium swap. So ilalagay ko yung mga link ng mga to sa description. So ano nga ba itong white elephant na to? Tignan natin guys. And meron pa nga pala silang nagawang isang game. Papakita ko sa inyo. So the same studio, Alimango Studios. And ito yung ginawa nilang isa, Pocket Gods. Sold out daw. So sa Solana din. So mahilig yung team na to sa Solana. Yan, Pocket Gods. And ito, para lay NFT. Sa kanila din ito. Check natin yung para lay NFT. Ito yung link tree nila. Magic Eden. Tignan natin kung magkano yung prices ng mga NFTs nila ngayon dito. So yung floor price nila is 18.5 sold. Wow, ang mahal din pala. So mukhang okay naman yung parlay nila. Check naman natin itong Pocket Gods. So check natin yung mga NFTs nila sa Magic Eden. Floor price is 0 0.47. Total volume is 1,258. Average sale for the last 24 hours is 0 0.52. Ayan. So mukhang nag low itong uh, Pocket Gods nila. Check naman natin to yung BJ nga pala na sinasabi ko guys. Since member sila dito, ito yung uh, Blockchain Game Alliance na website. Tignan natin yung mga members nila. Ubisoft. Wow! Medyo malalaking company pala to. Polygon. Ayan. Uh, BJ members. E2 Expand. Black Pigneo. Castle. Crypto. Engine. Malaki tong engine guys. And Everdream Soft. FYX. I'm sure familiar kayo dyan sa FYX. And Planetarium. Ito yung sa Nine Chronicles. Shepard Mullin. Bright Star Studios. Yung gumawa ng Ember Sword. And the Sandbox Ultra, Reality Gaming Group, Somnium Space, Seascape Network, Sky Mavis, Axie Infinity, Upland, Streaming Vast, Venly Horizon, NFT London, Altcoin Buzz, Block Chase, 
Dark Country ang dami. Ito naman yung website kung saan ako tumitingin dati ng mga latest play to earn game. Yan yung play to earn dot online. Bounty Block, Zarus, so may Atari din, Metamask, OpenSea, Salad, sobrang dami pala. Yan ito, Gala Games, Avalanche, GameFi, Guild of Guardians, Hodel God, and yung Jojo. Yan, makikita nyo dito yung mga legit na projects talaga. Dito din yung play to earn, Widow Games, cdfi.fund and ito white elephant so andito nga sila white elephant finance kinetic guild my lovely planet so kung gusto nyo palang mag research guys ng mga bagong NFT game or yung legitimacy ng game punta lang kayo dito sa blockchain game alliance Pero balik naman tayo dun sa white paper so meron akong nakita dito ang ecosystem so ayan magkakaroon din sila ng launch pad NFT staking staking portal token and yung fund token nga lock yung 250 million na fan token distribution naman nya pre-sale, IDO launchpad CX 10% marketing, billboards so magkaka billboards pa influencers 2% airdrops, lottery mainstream media, ecosystem development so yung fan token ito yung use case nya play to earn, pay to play staking, launch tier allocations P2P exchange, Fund Arcade currency kasi magkakaroon sila ng Fund Arcade dito. Ipapakita ko mamaya guys yung Elephant game nila. Yung White Elephant na parang Sonic the Hedgehog. So magkakaroon din sila ng revenue stream in the future. And meron din sila dito sa ecosystem guys yung trading bot. So we are developing a trading bot that could connect with centralized exchanges. Soon we'll release V1 of trading bot. This will be unlocked using our NFT. So in order to avail the training bot guys you need to get at least one nft this will connect to cx and will manage trades in any direction of any token or coin so pwede din daw sa cx or centralized exchange and snipe bot guys meron sila sa mga decentralized exchange like pucoin pancake swap and any other dex itong cx naman guys yung centralized exchange katulad ng binance kucoin MEXE Global, yung mga yon. So, arcade portal naman. Tignan natin. So, ito na guys yung games nila. Meron silang Funtran. Tapos, meron din silang P2P exchange and wallet dito. So, with on-ramp fiat to crypto and vice versa function via P2P for faster and efficient on-ramp. So, ito yung mission nila. Create an ecosystem that would complement all products in our platform. So, pwede daw lahat sa platform nila. And yung vision naman nila is to bring in more crypto participants from the Philippines, Southeast Asia, and Greater Asia. So, kaya sila siguro may launchpad guys para makapag-produce sila ng Web3 developers that could compete globally. Which is good para naman sa opinion ko kasi dito sa cryptocurrency world parang nagiging pantay-pantay yung mga nasa third world country and yung mga nasa ibang country. Countries. So yan yung mga ina-offer nila guys yung DX swap, pooling and staking, fund arcade, fund token, launchpad, P2P exchange and yung mission and vision nila. So ito naman yung mga solvent NFTs and ito yung use case nila. So magkakaroon tayo ng passkey for the trading bot, stake to earn from pools, number 3 is play to earn credits and 4 is metaverse and MMORPG characters. So yung roadmap nila guys, may nakita ulit ako dito na yung use case about dun sa bot. Uh, we are launching several bot to help our community in their crypto trading. We will release a sniper bot and trading bot. These bots can only be opened using the V1 NFT. So ibig sabihin limited edition itong mga NFTs na makukuha natin ngayon which is yung V1 NFTs. And the uh, trading bot is currently being tested. Tapos i -re release na daw nila yung mga bot kapag satisfied na sila. So mag-open din sila ng portal for the bot. And for the agri simulation game naman, these NFTs would also be used to stake for transaction mining. And they will share the income of the game via a pool that we will create. For V2 NFT naman, magiging character ito sa roguelike game nila. And the game will have RPG feel thus the NFT will play as the character in the game. So ito guys yung sinasabi nilang game. So sa ngayon wala pa siya, hindi pa siya masyadong nade-develop. Pero at least meron na siyang ganitong klaseng game na pwede mo nang kontrolin itong box na to. 
So ito yung parang magiging MMORPG game nila. For V3 NFT naman, this will be our Metaverse characters. Currently, this project is being designed and planned. The release date for this NFT would be on Q1, Q2, 2023 right after we alpha test our Metaverse. So sa 2023 pa yan. And makikita din natin dito sa white paper nila guys yung mga codes, node and RPC. Tapos yung technology na ginamit nila. So ito yung blockchain, scalable blockchain infrastructure, GitHub, Code, code Sandbox, Visual Studio, JavaScript Library, Unreal Engine, and Unity. Tapos makikita nyo dito guys yung Gitbook nila para naman dun sa software. So i-click nyo lang yan and mapupunta na kayo dun sa Gitbook. And yan, lahat ng information actually andito. So... Fully documented yung ginagawa nila na to guys. Kung gusto nyong mag Dior pa dito, punta lang kayo sa white paper nila. Andito na lahat ng information na kailangan nyong malaman. So sa mga interested guys, ilalagay ko itong link na to sa description box. Ito yung parang white listing form nila. Fill out nyo lang to and then mapapa white list na kayo. And kapag nakakuha kayo guys ng mga NFTs nyo, pwede nyo na siyang i-stake. Pero you need to wait for 30 days to unstake naman yung mga NFTs na yun. So yun lang guys yung about dito sa Solfant or White Elephant na project. Kung bago pa lang kayo sa channel, huwag nyo kalimutan na i-click yung subscribe button. Click nyo na din yung notification bell. Set nyo yun sa all para every time na meron tayong bagong upload na NFT game, potential token, Mano notify kayo. Yun lang guys. Maraming salamat. Bye bye. Disclaimer: This content is for education and entertainment purposes only. Galaran TV does not provide investment advice. The information is being presented without consideration of the investment objectives, risk tolerance, or financial circumstances of any specific investor, and might not be suitable for all investors. Past performance is not indicative of future results. All investing involves risk, including the possible loss of principal. Some videos have benefactors. Always do your own research. Never invest more than you are willing to lose.